Hi, I'm Brad, and this is the Moog Werkstatt. Today I'm going to teach you how to make your Werkstatt say wow. Now to do this only requires one additional piece of material besides your Werkstatt itself, and that is a single patch cable. We'll be using that last as we set this up. All right, so I've got the Werkstatt set kind of in the middle of everything. And if we set something or replace something, we hear this. So pretty basic. In order to set up your Werkstatt to say wow, the first thing we need to do is work through each of the settings. So first let's start with the VCO. I turn my frequency down just a little bit from middle. That is something you can adjust depending on how high a pitch you want. And we'll actually play with that later. You want to make sure your VCO is set to saw wave and the pulse width doesn't matter because we're using a saw wave. Now, what we want to do is we're going to want to take the cutoff down a bit, almost a little bit above a quarter. And we'll adjust that later, but that is a key adjustment in this. We'll also take the resonance and turn it up a bit. I don't hear anything to that just yet. Now the VCO mod, you can put on EG or LFO. We're gonna leave it on EG, but we're gonna play with that later. We'll go ahead and turn the amount way down on that, almost down to the bottom. And we'll leave this on frequency. For the VCF mod, we'll wanna set that to LFO as well. For that, you wanna turn it up down to about a quarter and make sure your polarity is negative. The LFO itself, we want to go ahead and turn down so it's at a nice, slow rate, kind of a wobble, just about like that, and set it to triangle. We'll want our sustain on, and now we're going to play with the attack and decay. We'll turn the attack down about a third, and the decay up just past center. We'll also make sure our glide is set somewhere around middle, and you can play with that as well. Now if we hit the buttons, we get a nice mellow sound. And this is where the patch cable comes in. We're going to want to connect the envelope gate out to the VCF in. We'll do that now. Now by doing that, we're going to create a little bit of feedback, which is going to make it say, wow. All right, so you notice there's a little bit of a buzz there. We can adjust that with the cutoff and resonance. What you want to do is adjust the cutoff until the buzz goes away. Right about there. If you adjust it too low, it just seems too muddy. If you adjust it too high, you get that buzz. So we're just going to find that spot. There it is. And we can adjust the resonance as well. Right about there. Now your Werkstatt says wow. And turn the frequency up a bit. Now for the fun part. We can turn this over to LFO. And play with the amount. And you get that wobble from the LFO. If we switch it back to envelope, we can play with this to really give it kind of a fun sound. Give it some expression. If we turn the frequency up, We've got a cat. <coughs> so now you can make your reverse shot say wow. wow. Always remember to favorite this, subscribe to my channel, and be sure and follow my Twitter feed in the links below. Thank you, and next time we'll be showing yours how to uh, have a bit of a bass.